Hello everyone and welcome to a very special video. It is October, which means only one thing, Halloween is coming up. So we are so I am going to be spending this month uh, not uh, we well actually we yeah, are why not reviewing all of uh, just watching a bunch of horror movies and reviewing them week by week. So um so for this, I have a whole bunch, uh, a whole collection of, uh, like a handful amount, I would, I would say like a handful amount of um, horror movies, scary movies that uh, I have binge watched uh, per week. Like, like maybe for example, uh, this past week I uh, watched all of the Child's Play slash Chucky movies. And next week, I'm thinking about doing uh, uh, Friday the 13th, and then maybe the next week after that, you know, um, I don't know. For example, let's go with uh, A Nightmare on Elm Street, and the week after that, Halloween, and then, you know. So, just a whole collection. So, I'm not going to be reviewing, like, each individual movies. That's going to take a lot of time, and I don't have that, so might as well... Have it put it all in one video. So, as I said, uh, this past week I have reviewed all of the child's play. I'll, I'll go with Chucky. I've reviewed all the Chucky uh, movies, um, and um, let's get right into it. <clears throat> so, the Chucky movies. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing really. I mean, there's nothing really. There's nothing to it. I mean, the first movie, the first Child's Play movie, um, I didn't even like it. Like, the whole idea of a doll getting, like, a serial killer named, there's a serial killer, her name, his name is uh, Charles Lee Way. Um, he's a serial killer, uh, and one night he transferred, he goes into this toy shop, and he transfers his himself, himself into... Uh, a good guy, uh, a good guy, uh, toy, a toy doll, uh, named Chucky, and later on, uh, this kid, this little boy, it's his birthday, and his name is Andy, and on his birthday, he, his mom surprises him with a Chucky, uh, doll, and then all hell breaks loose. Shit hits the fan. <laughs> and this doll is going around uh, killing people. And I think it's just pretty ridiculous. Like, these, this the whole franchise is pretty ridiculous and insane. Um, it's, this, it's not really scary. I mean, a doll... I mean, I feel like it's... It doesn't make any sense. I feel like um, just this doll coming to life... Like, this doll is, like, what? Like, three, four feet tall? I don't know how tall... Um, I don't know how tall the doll is, but it's shorter than a human being. That's for sure. And, like, something so... Sh something so small and made out of plastic or rubber going around ch jumping and biting people. I... I... I this whole... I feel like this is in... This is not... This is not scary at all. This is hilarious. <laughs> There's so many times in there's so many moments in this entire series um, in this franchise that is just it's so ridiculous because I can't take it seriously that's my yeah that's what I'm trying to say that's my point I, I just can't take it seriously because like this short small little doll going around killing people stabbing people I mean like what the hell um yeah, this isn't scary at all. I feel like this isn't. I, I feel like it's a comedy. Child's Play, Chucky. These Chucky movies are a fucking comedy, and I don't really care. Give a shit about any of the human characters. I don't give a shit about Andy. Like the first, the first movie. You know, it's his birthday, and you know, like I said, and then the second movie, he gets adopted. Uh, his mother is like I don't even remember. Um, he gets adopted um, in this new family. And then, of course, you know, people don't believe him. Like, it's pretty unbelievable. It's literally unbelievable. Um, 
of, of a dog coming to life, a, a toy coming to life and killing people. Um, and then the third movie, Andy goes to some kind of art, like army. I don't care. I just don't care. And there's like a romance. <laughs> what? Oh my god. And then you fast forward to uh, the modern reboot where there's like a girl. I think her name is like, I don't even remember. Like, it starts with the letter N, like Nakia, Nakaya, whatever. Um, and she's in a wheelchair and. And there's, you know, the modern reboot. I would say, even though, like I, even though I, I will say, um, it is kind of ridiculous, um, and just hard to believe. I actually am interested. I'm actually am interested in a modern reboot. Like the reason, like what I mean, what I mean by that is like the Curse of Chucky, like the Curse of Chucky, and then the sequel, Cult of Chucky. And then there might be a third movie coming soon because it seems like because now uh, Chucky, one of the Chucky's, uh, possessed uh, the woman in the wheelchair. I forgot her name. Uh, it's, like I said, it starts to starts to the letter N uh, as a Nancy, but um, I don't. But yeah, sh and then there's Tiffany. Oh my God! The first two movies, the first like I said, I don't give a shit about like the second and the third movie. There's no character development. I, I just I'm, there's no character that I'm latched onto. So what? If, so what if Andy's the main character? There's a lot of. So what if you know? It, it's just there are other protagonists. There are other horror, scary or scary protagonists that I feel are much better, like Ripley from the Alien movies. Um, but uh, yeah, it just it's that's pretty much it. And don't even get me started with the bite of Chucky and the fucking seed of Chucky. What the fuck? Like the <sighs> the seed of Chucky. The the bite of Chucky. I mean, we you know, bite of Chucky. Uh, Chucky meets like pretty much. It falls in love with like the with the female like <laughs> the, the the female version of himself, which is Tiffany. Um, and then the two of them go around, they team up, they go around killing people. Um, there's a fucking doll sex scene. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck am I watching? What the fuck is this, this movie? And then don't even get me started with Cedar Chucky. That, that movie is just horrendous. It's an abomination. Oh my god. It's atrocious. That movie is atrocious. <laughs> like... I don't Glenn Glenda <laughs> Glenn is it Glenn is it Glenda why is he slash she why are they speaking Japanese what and then the fucking end of the movie where I'm gonna call him Glenn Glenn is uh <laughs> performing like some kung fu martial arts and like <laughs> Jumping around, <laughs> oh my god, it was. It kind of reminded me of the uh, what was that? The H2O 20 years later. Oh my god, the Halloween movie H2. I don't know what the fuck it's. <laughs> oh my god, I you know, I have officially confirmed 100% confirmed that the Chucky movies, these movies are not scary, they're not, they're hilarious. They're fucking, they're, they're fucking comedy is what they are. Because I, I just can't take it seriously. I mean, of a fucking doll, a small little doll is capable, is so strong, is strong in, like this doll that's made out of plastic, but apparently is filled with meat and blood, can, is strong enough to kill all these people and like, jump up and open locks and open doors and it's it's I, I, I just can't take it seriously that's one of my, my point so anyway that's all I have to say for um, this Chucky franchise the first two like so you know the first movie is like so to recap um, the first movie it's Andy's birthday and it's Andy's birthday, and he gets 
uh, the good guy Chucky doll for his birth as his birthday present, and then shit hits the fan. The do doll goes loose and goes killing people. Um, and the second movie, Andy gets adopted um, with this this new family, this new cast, uh, these new people. And the third movie, Andy goes. And there's like an older, it's a, like a teenage version of Andy. He's in college, or not college, excuse me, um, ar he's in the army, um, this military, whatever, uh, and then, like, the bite of Chucky, and the bite of Chucky, Chucky meets the love, the love is, the love of his life, Tiffany, and the two of them team up, and they go around killing people, see the Chucky, I don't, I don't even know what, I don't, that movie is just atrocious, I'm not even gonna talk about that movie, and then you fast forward to like, uh, like almost like around a decade later, with uh, the 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 curse of Chucky, like the modern reboot. Um, and then the curse of the the curse of Chucky and then the cult of Chucky, where it explores like the origin and the relationship with Charles Lee Ray. And what you know, his ties with the uh, the woman uh, who's in the wheelchair, um, and you know it offers it. It is is a tiny little bit interesting, but um, yeah, I I would say yeah, I am kind of interested in seeing a third movie. I I I don't know if they're making a third movie, but yeah, there's the Curse of Chucky, the Cold of Chucky, and then the my, maybe a third movie because now Chucky is inside uh, the woman. The wheelchair woman, uh, woman's body. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about um, this whole the Chucky franchise. Do you think it's ridiculous? Because I, I I can't take it seriously. Because I can't take it seriously of this whole Chucky doll going around killing people. It's laughable. It's ridiculous. It's funny. Like there's so many times in the movie where it's supposed to be scary, but I'm over here laughing my ass off because I just, like I said, I said it a bunch of times and I'll keep saying it. I can't take this fucking movies, these Chucky movies seriously. <laughs> it's hilarious. This is a comedy. This is what it is. It's a fucking comedy. Um, just want to throw popcorns at the TV. Um, but anyway, let me know what you guys think about it, and I will see you in my next video.